CBS 4 News team coverage moves north now to Broward. Joan, Joan Murray has been there all day for us. All right, Joan, so what are county leaders there saying? Mainly take the storm seriously. The Broward Emergency Operations Center here is fully activated. Dozens of people working together monitoring the storm and planning the strategy of a response. The 311 Center is in this building, also fully operated right now. That 311 number to be used if you have a hurricane related message or a question. Um, there is a delay. You may have to wait up to 15 minutes or more, but they say use patience. Uh, they will get to you eventually. Now, shelters in Broward have been open since noon. That's for five hours. And from what we've seen, people are taking the evacuation seriously. Some people are on the road leaving town. Others are going to the designated shelters, mainly, mainly schools here in Broward County. Uh, 14 shelters are now open. About a thousand people have gone there, we're told. And that's anyone in the evacuation zone east of US-1, including the Barrier Islands, anyone who lives in a mobile home park or a low-lying area, also urged to evacuate. And when you go to the shelter, make sure you take everything you need with you. One of the things that we've done since Wilma is strengthen our infrastructure. Most of you have seen uh, these uh, very tall uh, concrete poles going up in your neighborhoods. That has been a, a significant part of hardening and supporting our infrastructure. And uh, they will uh, withstand much higher wind strengths. That will allow us, again, to restore more quickly. Also, we have learned uh, and implemented significant uh, pre-storm preparations. We have many uh, uh, situations where we actually do uh, storm preparation routines so that we are uh, drills so that we will be prepared for any eventuality. And that's Florida Power and Light talking about the Florida Power and Light talking about that they are very prepared for the storm. They have crews in place ready to tackle any down power lines. Now, for a complete list of shelters in Broward County, go to CBSMiami.com. Reporting live in Plantation, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.